Hi guys, what's up? Okay, sorry for that. <laughs> I am sitting in my living room and I'm trying to record this video in daylight because today I am actually doing a video which a lot of you enjoy a lot. Lipstick swatches. These are some of the shades which I really like currently and you know the reason why I'm doing it in daylight is so that you have a proper idea of how the colors look in daylight. I don't have any studio lights around me. I have also not put a lot of makeup, compact and concealer, that's about it, no foundation. So now without further ado, let's begin with swatch number one. I'm really worried about the daylight. I have to do this quickly. The first one which I'm going to show you is from Sephora. It is their lip blush and this is in the shade 07. Made in Korea. Oh, sorry. 07 is the shade number. It doesn't have a name. This is actually a lip and cheek product. You can use it on your lips. You can use it as a blush. And it is a beautiful product, guys. I have used this a lot. It is not transfer proof, but it gives like a nice little flush on your cheeks and it looks velvety on the lips. I'm going to apply it and show it to you, of course. This is my MLBB product, my lips but better. You can of course build it up as for your own liking but I like to apply like a thin layer of it because it just looks so natural and velvety on the lips. The staying power is decent, you'll definitely need a touch up once you eat or drink something but it's it just looks beautiful guys. I really like the fact that it looks very natural on the lips. The second lip color that we have here is from Kira Beauty. It's Kira Beauty liquid lipstick in the shade Peachy Nude. It's a transfer proof liquid lipstick which feels very comfortable on the lips. Let me put it on and show you. The staying power is good but just like every other liquid lipstick you'll have to touch it up after you eat anything oily or actually it can survive drinks so drinks is not an issue but yeah if you do have your meals you'll have to touch it up also this particular shade is only suitable for fair to medium skin tones it can wash out deeper skin tones the next lip color which i've got here is from sephora again it is their lip stain in the shade 80 here is the hand swatch of this particular lip color and to be very honest this is probably one of the most comfortable liquid lipstick that I've tried out. It is so comfortable on the lips and plus it is long lasting. It can survive light meals and drinks easily only when you have something oily you will need to touch them up but the pigmentation is solid. It is strong. Now let's put this on. It is definitely a lightweight lipstick but I would still recommend that you apply a thin layer of lip balm before you put it on. You won't be able to feel a thing honestly because it's seriously so lightweight but I love it. It's so pigmented and so nice. Next I've got a lip colour from Lacme. It is a matte melt liquid lip colour in the shade Pink Silk. It's a beautiful pink color which is quite pigmented and these liquid lip colors are also quite comfortable to wear. However, it's always better that you apply a thin layer of lip balm before putting on any liquid lipstick no matter how comfortable it is. Because after some time, these long lasting liquid lipsticks do tend to get a bit too dry on your lips. I really think that this is one of those perfect pink colors which can go well with so many outfits and just so many makeup looks. This is such a beautiful pink color. Next we have something from K-Beauty. This right here is a bullet lipstick in the shade Backstage. It is not a transfer proof lipstick. It is something that you'll have to touch up after your meals and your drinks but the pigmentation is pretty strong and I love this color. This is 
one of those shades which can instantly brighten up your face. I love to apply it when I'm doing neutral makeup looks or no makeup makeup looks. It just adds that really nice pop of color to the lips. Next, I'm going to show you a lip color which I actually used to apply when I used to go to the gym. I don't believe in applying makeup while going to the gym, but I used to enjoy applying like a little bit of lipstick or a little bit of tint. That was a long time ago and I bought two of these since then. It is from Sugar. It's a matte attack transfer proof lipstick in the shade Peachwood MAC. This is also one of those MLBB colors. It looks very natural on the lips. I'll show you. It is a comfortable lipstick but it tends to start coming off from the inner corners of your lips when you have your meals and stuff and after a few hours you know so you definitely need a touch of them but overall I love the color and I love the finish and the pigmentation is pretty solid we are down to final four lipstick and actually the next two lipsticks that I'm going to show you are from Sugar. Sugar has some really nice lipsticks guys. I love their shade range. They've got some really pretty and nice colors. Alright, next I've got here Sugar Matte as Hell. Matte as Hell? Yeah, Matte as Hell crayon lipstick in the shade Brandy Harrington. It's a really nice brownish pink shade. I had been looking for this shade for a very long time. It is out of stock on Nykaa. I actually bought this from Amazon. Love this color. It is not a transfer proof lipstick and it will of course come off if you have your meals or even with drinks it does transfer a bit but the shade range of these crayons is amazing. I love the colors that they've got. It is supremely pigmented and it does look matte as hell. Overall good value for money. Next we have your Sugar Nothing Else Matter Long Wear Lipstick in the shade Simmer Brown. This is such a beautiful and rich terracotta brown color. It looks so beautiful on the lips guys. I dig this color. I totally love it. Again, it is out of stock on Nykaa and I bought this from Sugar's counter. Like I long ago I went to a store and bought it. But I think it is available on Amazon. I'll leave all the links in the description box below anyway. I'll try and find all the links and Put them down below. It is a long wear comfortable lipstick but in my personal experience you will have to touch it up after your meals and even after your drinks for that matter like it does not last as long as a transfer proof lipsticks the matte attack i think it's called matte attack that one is more long lasting but i love this color so much that i don't mind touching it up next we've got bobby brown crush liquid lip in the shade give a fig it is a glossy lip color guys. This is actually like a lip gloss. It just feels so nice on the lips. Like I don't know how to explain the formula to you. If you've used Laneige lip balm, it sort of feels like that on your lips but it is not sticky at all. You can apply a thin layer of it for a flush of color on your lips or you can you know build up the pigmentation. It is so comfortable to wear. Honestly, whenever I apply this on my lips, I feel like I've applied like a super nourishing lip balm on my lips. It feels so nice on the lips. Beautiful product, beautiful formula. Down to the last and final one. And this product has the cutest packaging ever. When I looked at it, I was like, oh my god, this is so cute. It is from MAC Cosmetics. It is their Ruby Boo Powder Kiss Liquid Lip Color. 
We all know about Ruby Woo, right? Ruby Woo is MAC Cosmetics' iconic red matte lipstick. It's got mixed opinions. Some people like it, some people don't like it, but I love the color. And MAC Cosmetics actually launched three new textures with the same color. They got Powder Kiss Liquid Lip Color, they got Powder Kiss Bullet Lip Color, they got a retro matte liquid lip color, and the fourth one is the classic matte lipstick. My favorite formula out of the three new ones that they got is Ruby Boo. It is a powder kiss liquid lip color. The formula is amazing of this lipstick guys, it just feels so comfortable on the lips and it gives like a velvety finish. That is how the powder kiss formula is but what I specifically love about this particular color in this formula is that I can build it up. If I want I can apply a very thin layer of this color to have just a flush of red on my lips or I can apply it like this full pigmentation beautiful red color. It is not exactly transfer proof but it is long lasting. The color and you know the hint of color kind of stays on your lips for a pretty long time and that's it the video is done i love doing lipstick swatches for you guys but it gets very confusing because i have so many lipsticks that i love i try and not do more than 10 swatches in one video because number one it gets confusing as hell and secondly my lips do burn a lot they are already burning quite a bit but i don't care i love doing these videos now let's talk about something very serious and important so we have a brand and it's called house of sharome i'm actually wearing a t-shirt from our brand <laughs> actually a lot of you know about it if you haven't checked out our brand i am going to leave the link of the website in the pinned comment of the comment section below we've got some really good quality stuff t-shirts sweatshirts mugs and we will be launching luxury candles this month hopefully this month as well you can check out the link and if you do like something then please consider buying it now it's time for me to pack up everything in the living room Thank you so much for watching this video guys. Please take care of yourself and stay safe. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.